See, I told y'all it was going to be something. I told you we was going to get a drop to kick off the week. Let's go. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Jay with Brother Cousins Toy Reviews, and that's right, I am back with the news. Some real exciting news, by the way. Now, we all knew that we were going to be getting a Deadpool figure. As soon as that Wolverine, Deadpool Wolverine figure came out a couple weeks ago, we knew that Deadpool was a human, right? It's his own movie. Um, we also saw uh, some footage. We also saw some pictures of the Deadpool figure being posed with that Wolverine figure um, a couple weeks ago as well. So we all knew that this was coming. So let's just jump right into it. Definitely, definitely. Um, we're going to read this. I usually don't read these descriptions, but, you know, I think uh, it's time for us to read this, this description right now. Um, I'm not going to read the whole thing, but um, it says the Merc with the Mouth is about to invade your collection to celebrate the highly anticipated Deadpool and Wolverine movie. Hot Toys is thrilled to unveil uh, the new 1-6 scale Deadpool collectible figure. Get ready to bring this wisecracking anti-hero to life on your shelves. Um, the movie accurate collectible figure is specially crafted based on his appearance in the Deadpool and uh, of Deadpool in the film. It features a masked head with an array of interchangeable eyepieces, allowing fans to recreate Deadpool's ever shifting expressions from mischievous to murderous. The figure's signature red and black suit is highly tailored with exquisite precision which improves the range of articulation we definitely needed that um while the selection of deadpool signature weaponry is included a pair what is included is a pair of gleaming katana with sheath a deadly dagger a deadly dagger pistols and interchangeable hands allowing posing the figure in an array of dynamic gestures this figure also features dog pool in one six scale there you go um, guess what? More of Deadpool will be unveiled soon, so stay tuned for the surprise. It also has down here, and this is going to be, you know, this, you, you guys are definitely going to find this interesting for all you guys that like the uh, exclusivity. A special edition available in selected markets will include a pair of pistols painted in metallic gold and a specially designed figure stand wow reserve this deadpool figure alongside wolverine to make an absolute epic diorama take advantage take advantage of this opportunity a, uh, a special and beautifully crafted one six scale figure from deadpool and wolverine and wolverine collection is set to make its grand debut in mid-august there's a catch First, 500 fans in Hong Kong who make a purchase of the 1-6 scale Deadpool collectible figure will uh, will entitle exclusive priority to secure this 1-6 scale mystery item before anyone else. Stay tuned for more details coming soon. So, wow, that is amazing. Um, so what it looks like, what they're saying there, ladies and gentlemen, that... Um, that you're not only getting this figure, but you're going to be getting an exclusive version of this figure with the gold-plated Desert Eagles uh, and a special, uh, a special, uh, a special base. And then you're also getting a mystery figure that is going to be exclusive to certain markets. And the first 500 people in Hong Kong that pre-order, I think both figures will be able to get this. So I'm not sure what the U.S. is going to do, how they're going to do us over here. But uh, you know it's going to be an exclusive, a special exclusive time release that Sideshow will do. And we'll all go crazy and have to get in the damn queue. That's what they do now. That's This is the new, this, this is the new thing. So... I don't know, but uh, yeah, but anyway, guys, let's look at the pictures real quick. That's what we're here for, right? We're here for them damn pictures. Let's look at this wonderful figure. First up, let's look at, before we do that, let's look at this joint right here. <laughs> that looks fantastic. Looks very cool that we're getting dog pool. Very excited for that. Very excited to be getting dog pool. So that looks very, very, very cool. Let's go ahead and blow up the pictures. And man, that looks great. 
the fact that you can do this gesture is going to be uh, amazing. Uh, let me go back. So I like starting like the pictures like this. So there he is, the Deadpool figure. We we've seen this for weeks. We knew that this was going to be coming. We knew that we were going to be getting this. So I mean, it ain't no surprise. It really isn't no surprise. But it looks damn good. And when they say we needed another one that you know that helped with the articulation because the the suit i still i'm still rocking my first deadpool i got the one from uh the first movie that had all the problems back in the day remember that shit remember all the problems make sure my mic is close here we go remember all the problems we had with that figure and i mean it was just uh, the shit with the hands and the gloves tearing the suit apart it's just been a lot and mine's just like i mean it's kind of disintegrating it is like the little pads on the shoulder are like um starting to uh rip a little bit the padding under the shoulder guards that's uh the pleather material starting to flake a little bit it's just a lot of problems and i don't have that many figures that flake but that one did and it's just oh, man that figure was uh it, it's just a whole pile of shit but it still looks so damn cool and actually it looking kind of beat up kind of goes with deadpool so yeah i still got this one the, se the deadpool from the second movies the deadpools from the second movie were pretty cool i know those were like the ones to have for a while um but i'm so glad that we're getting this one and this one is you know from the mcu and it's man it looks good the suit is great i really like the little gold bits i like the little deadpool like uh the little eyes that are on the belt on the belt buckle right there they did an excellent job on that the pouches and everything it they just it just looks way more detailed so this is uh upgrade i'm very very excited to have man just looks good um let's continue looking at the pictures here we are they talk about the range of motion and articulation you can see that right there looks good definitely be able to get in a pose like this without having to worry about the shit so i'm definitely happy about that like i said the suit the d design on the suit i mean real faithful to the suits that we've gotten in the past from the deadpool movies but they just up their game on this one i love the gold bits love how it just comes together it's just something about it that just looks really good um and actually more and dare i say it more comic accurate in a way but still in the movie universe they do their own thing but it looks good it really does i love the little hits of gold looks great once again we look at him in dog pool and i'm sure we get a closer look at him with it but man that that's that's just fucking hilarious it really is it's really hilarious this is going to be what everybody is going to do you know having him and wolverine together we've been waiting years for this we've been waiting damn near 10 years for this you know what i'm saying from the deadpool movie, from the first deadpool movie he was always dropping hugh jackman's name always dropping wolverine's name so yeah man it's going to be cool that we're actually going to get uh you know wolverine a wolverine a comic a, you know closely comic accurate wolverine figure with this figure so i mean shit i think when this wolverine dropped it broke the internet so to have them both together come on this is the way to this is the way to do it you know what i'm saying i don't know guys is it me or does it look like wolverine's claws are looking like kind of janky right here in this picture they look weird i don't i don't know maybe it's just my eyes but i hope they do die cast guys i really do i don't think i mean because i don't, I don't know if they're going to but man I, I hope they find a way to to update this and make these die casts I, I hope they figure that out because it makes no sense to have my other wolverine figures have die cast claws and then go plastic on this one i mean the last wolverine has plastic claws because they're bone but days of future past was die cast so can we get die? and you know who knows you know so if it looks cool i'm down with it i'm down with it but here you go you get the uh, interchangeable expressions we've seen this with deadpool and spider-man figures for years so nothing new here just the you know different variations you can do with the look and the expressions so you know you got him looking you know got him looking goofy with his eyes wide you got him looking like he about to kill your ass and other expressions you got him looking confused it's cool all for a great character um there he is once again just a great figure and even in this pose right here this is all you need this is really i mean 
that's just cool. That's that just says it all. You talk about a character pose. There you go. Just looks fantastic, guys. It really does. Just really looks fantastic. It really looks damn good. Um, there he is doing the heart. Love it. <laughs> you can have a lot of fun with Deadpool. I mean, you can put Deadpool's a figure you can put anywhere. I've seen people, you know, buy, I think local, my guy, local Lou, bought the uh, Back to the Future 2 DeLorean and he threw Deadpool in it. You know what I'm saying? And it, it works great. You can take the bat pot and throw Deadpool on it. It works. You know what I'm saying? He works everywhere. So, I mean, just a great figure. Look, look at that. This this just, you know, just the just the feminine shit he does. He's just, I love it. I love it. He's just awesome. <laughs> he is so cool. And then you get cool, super cool poses like this. I mean, the articulation, you know, from what they're able to do now with ratcheted joints and everything, I mean. This is definitely, if you're looking to upgrade your Deadpool, this is the way to go, guys. It really is. Um, you got him twirling the pistols. That looks awesome right there. That looks cool. Really looks good. Damn, that looks good. Ooh, look at that. Look at that action pose. Look at that action pose. The lighting on this picture is kind of weird, but... uh. It's cool that we get this photographer, in the, you know, but uh, it, 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 it's a cool looking pose. Look at that. Man. That's I think this is how mine is going to be posed. I do. I think this is how my figures are going to be posed. I ain't even going to lie. We'll go back to this video a year from now and be like, yep, Jay stole that pose. I sure enough did. I sure enough did. Once again, the figure looks amazing. Looks good. Wow, he has the little emblems under the clips. <laughs> that is so cool. So cool. Another great shot. You can have a lot of fun with this figure, guys. This is going to be... This is going to be the one. This is definitely going to be the one. You got to have these. You got to have this set. Okay, so here it is. More Deadpool to be revealed. So they're hiding a lot of stuff from us, which is why... I think they're kind of late on giving us this release because they didn't want to, uh, or this announcement, they didn't want to, they don't want to spoil it. They don't want to spoil the movie, but um, they got to get these figures out. So it's not much to really go go on here. Um, they don't even have a close-up shot of dog pool. You know what I'm saying? Which which probably means they're still working on it. Um, but it says more to be revealed. So you got all the facial expressions. The, you got the um, you got him looking cool as hell. That's a great shot there. Him with the katana. You got him with the katanas on his back. You got all his guns and bullets. And of course, you got his crotch there. You got that wonderful, beautiful knife that's in the sheath on his leg. A pile of hands and a cool ass face. And no, Howie did not give me boots. He is listening. Howard, you're listening. Boots are not a boots are not of his. They're not a damn accessory. Remember, guys, buy my merch. Buy my merch. The shirts are in the shop. Just click the link below and buy, and buy my merch. But uh, it looks good, man. I think they did an excellent job with this figure, um, with the prototype anyway. So I, I can't wait for it, guys. I really can't wait for it. I can't wait for the movie. Um, what we got? We got about a week and a half or something like that. You know what I'm saying? We got roughly two weeks. Roughly, roughly two weeks. So, yeah, about a week, about a week and six days or something like that. I don't know, man, but it's getting close. That's all I can say. It is getting close. So, man, yeah, figure I, I like it. I think it looks great. I'm definitely going to be uh, pre-ordering this bad boy. Definitely. This and Wolverine are both of them are coming home. These are these are the figures for next for 2025. These are the figures I want the most there. I said it the most um so yeah that's gonna be it ladies and gentlemen um i hit 5k uh so thank you thank you all very much um it's been a long road hitting 5k um i've been doing this channel since 20 since early 2019 and you know it's been a while it's been a long haul it really has been and i just want to all thank you all very much for subscribing watching my content and just riding with me through the years i really appreciate it guys 5k means 
you know, I know a lot of people are hitting big numbers now, but 5K really means something special to me. It really does. Um, so I just always prayed to get to be at 5K. So to be at 5K, man, it's 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 unbelievable, to be quite honest with you. It is unbelievable. And I just want to thank you all so much for spending time with me, watching the content, engaging with the content and and just, you know, just being there. You know, it really does mean a lot. It really does. Once again, thank you all so much. We got a lot more stuff coming this week. Um, best of the best this week um, with Copper Drop. I believe we're doing that this week. Stick, stay tuned for more details. It's going to be amazing. Me, Collector Joey, his crew, my crew. It's going to be amazing. Um, so definitely um, stick around for that on Thursday. And if any other thing drops, Definitely, Brother Cousins Toy Reviews will be on top of it. Stay with us for all your Hot Toys and 1-6 scale news. Got to throw N-Art in there as well. Hot Toys, N-Art, J&D, statues, all of it. We cover here. So definitely um, continue to watch this channel. Continue to subscribe. Continue to watch it. And uh, yeah, man, we'll probably be doing a contest or something pretty soon who knows you may be able to win this deadpool figure when it drops so um yeah we'll talk to you later i'm rambling now deuces we out